All right, hey everyone. Hey welcome. Everyone. Welcome to Game Time Fun Yay. Star Wars edition. Yes, it is 12:21 a.m. on oh, uh, November 17th. We just picked up Battlefront. He literally came from GameStop and are playing it right yeah. now. Yeah. Also, I bought a PS4. So that's exciting. So uh, that and this you can is continue playing This is going to be the cold open just because we thought this was really cool. This is what happens while the game is installing. Like, there's uh, a game happening while the game is installing. Yeah, it's just a mini game where you just kill rebel scum. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And Ashton is here with us. Ashton, you want to say hello? Hello. Ashton's joining Ashton. us. <laughs> yeah, see, this is Ashton. <laughs> you can't see him. Uh, he's <laughs> handsome. I mean, can't see you guys either. That's true, but we have little cartoon versions of ourselves. Oh, that's true. I'm kind of... Yeah, you're a shadow figure. I'm a... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so yeah, he's and he's here so that we can get this done and uploaded ASAP. As soon as possible, yeah. for those who didn't know. All right, let's roll that intro. Yes. Game time! Game time fun, yeah! Game time fun, yeah! Game time fun, yeah! yeah. I'm Darth Vader and I'm running. Rebel reinforcements. Is the game incoming? Yeah, I'd like to play the game now. Not that this isn't amazing. It's incredible, but I want to play with Roman. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, man. Ooh, this is a hard decision. Whatever one you do now, we'll do the opposite. Okay. I'm going to be the Galactic Empire so that we can be rebels together. That's I like that. There's oh, so the Han Solo many... gun. It came with you. You bought the Han Solo thing. That's it. No, wait, no. Is that it? Yes. That's definitely the Han Solo gun, right? Yeah. Yes. It looks like the Han Solo gun. How do you crouch like that? Circle is crouch. You can go into first person? Yeah. That's no fun, though. It's not Battlefront. That's Call of Duty front. Ashton is already hard at work editing this episode. How, you ask? Movie magic. Does it sound good? He's already excited. He's it giggling. So <laughs> <laughs> what could go wrong in Star Wars and video games? Awesome. Have you fired a shot yet? I haven't seen anybody yet. <laughs> did what you ever you guys play? Um, did you ever see how Arkham Origins threw in a multiplayer and it was total uh, half baked? I did not. Um, it was a really cool premise. I was super into the idea. It was three v three v two, all on the same map. That was a good shot, man. Um, man, this gun is strong. And so what it was was it was a team of three people that played as either. Joker's mercenaries or Bane's mercenaries. Oh, and cool. they could then, similar to how this, you unlock a Force character, you know? Yeah. Um, you could unlock Bane or the Joker and play as them for a little bit. That's cool. Um, and so they were using guns and stuff, obviously, and then a separate team of two was Batman and Robin. And it was oh, it was uh, Dick Grayson. So, like, yeah, you're like me. I was super pumped for the idea. And then I remember talking about it with a friend, and, my, and this friend was like, it looks terrible. It's going to be so bad. And uh, he was right, and I didn't want him to be. I really wanted it to be good. I didn't even get a chance to play it because um, by the time I finally... Actually, it wasn't even that long. Like, I bought Ark Mordens when it came out. I learned how to play the game, you know, and then tried to play it online. And no one was playing online anymore. Weird. It was a total bummer. I really wanted to play it. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Well, right in the back, you know, like, so like heroes. I do wish there was a, a story, though. Yeah. It's a little bit of a bummer. Because Star, Star Wars is known for its storytelling. Mm-hmm. Like, maybe not... Ba maybe Battlefront, maybe not so much, but Star Wars as a whole. And with the possibility... I think I mentioned this to you before, but not on, like, on recording. But it's a game that's considered canon. Mm hmm So, like, everything that happens, like, in the world of the game, like, the established area that, that we're in is now factual in the Star Wars But universe. maybe maybe that's why it's canon, though, is because it doesn't really reveal anything. Yeah, that's true. It's just locations and people. I'm excited for so, the Battle of Jakku. Yeah, that'll be cool. And like you said, Boba Fett's in it, so that means if it's canon, either Boba Fett's alive or someone's using all of his armor and stuff, which would be cool. I would actually be kind of into the idea if it's not Boba Fett at all. That would be crazy. And it's just someone... I would hope not a relative again, because, you know, that's how he kind of became to be. He, you know, his dad was a bounty hunter, and he became a bounty hunter that dressed in green <laughs> instead of blue. Uh, so, but it'd be kind of cool if it was just someone who found someone took up the mantle his of like stuff. Not that to, I guess it's weird to compare it to Princess Bride, but like the what Dread a Pirate good Roberts movie, right? Where it's like, okay, you are now Boba Fett. Yeah. 
Princess Bride, though, good movie. Yeah, well, yeah. We never talked about it, but it's a good movie. I'm glad. I should have known you would like that movie. It's oh, yeah. a very Matt movie. It's amazing. It's so funny. It's, it's like, My... it's a great movie, almost in spite of itself. Yeah. Whoa, that Stormtrooper does not have a helmet on, and it's a lady. Cool. Which is cool. Okay. It, it so, plays so... real nice so far. This Han Solo gun is just It's a so wreck. strong. I don't know if mine came with that. I didn't get the same edition Matt got. No. I got the PlayStation 4 bundle, though, so I got all these old Star Wars games. Yeah, <laughs> like old ports. But I'm excited. Like it's nice to have this Han Solo gun for the purpose. This purpose because it makes me look really good, even if I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, you're. It's like one shot killing them. Yeah. Maybe I'm just really good at aiming. It looks like the auto aim is actually pretty good. I'm not. That's not a dig on your skills. <laughs> I always like it when there's a game with a strong auto aim because, like, Red Dead Redemption was so good at that. Like you could just quickly press L1 and it was there. Mm. I was I love satisfactory. It when you talk dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Behave. I like the battle damage on your armor. Yeah, that's cool. Was that in two? Could the PS2 do that? I don't <laughs> think that was a thing. Like, no. It's really pretty. This is a good-looking game. Yeah, it is. Any more though? Like, I feel like that that means less. That makes me sad. But they, well, of course, it looks good. That's the expectation. Yeah, but. I like it when games look good, but also stylized. Yeah. Like, it's cool if a game has a certain aesthetic. And maybe I, that's why... That's another reason I'm not the biggest Call of Duty fan. Because it's just kind of... It's like, yeah, it looks It's real. boring looking. Yeah. Yeah. Also, I tend to get bored with just generic shooters. Yeah. I say generic because, like, this is Star Wars. It's weird. You know, it's got yeah. a thing. And there's not a, there's not a Battlefront coming out every year. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously, it's been eight years since the last one. I'm not actually sure, but it's been way too long. I think it has to have been longer, right? Because it was... It's, we were saying earlier... It was PS2. Earlier, it skipped, we were, it skipped yeah. the PS3. And we were saying earlier that it's been almost 10 years now since Kingdom Hearts, or it's coming up on... It's nine, so yeah, it's been almost 10 years. And this was... Battlefront 2 was out before Kingdom Hearts 2, wasn't it? I'm trying to think? Ashton, you're on a computer. Oh, you're not on the internet, though. Hmm. So you're right in here. But you are a human computer, right? I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure it came out before... Uh, King Mars too. Yeah, there we go. Pretty sure I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> that's all we asked for. Ashton, the human computer. That's why. That's why they call him that. Does anyone call you that? I mean, you could start. Yeah, exactly. I was gonna say trick <laughs> question. They do now. Oh, good thing those boxes didn't explode. Do you have a sniper rifle? I believe it's a pulse. Oh, uh, I, I just died the first time. I'm really proud of that. Yeah, you kicked rump. I was killed by. You haven't used the turret yet. You should try that out. Ooh. Ooh, ah. How long do these battles go for? Oh, seven minutes left. Seven minutes left. It's counting up, so we've been playing for seven minutes. Oh. But it looks like it's a counter up at the top, where it's out of 100. So I don't know if it's 100 kills, because I feel like I've killed a lot of people. If it's 100 kills, that means you're a third of the way there. <laughs> That's a long fight. And you collect these things? And they're like... That's health? They're bonuses. Oh, Like, yeah. I just picked up a thermal imploder. And that's R L1 and R1. And, yeah, hit those two together. Cool. It sets it off. This and is awesome. Like a giant fireball that you throw. Oh, yes, I've seen you throw those. To, like, now, in this game. Yeah. Oh, there's... The, okay, so, look to your left, on top of that AT-AT, there's a diamond, and I'm just noticing above your little radar, it says ah. collectibles, zero out of five. Oh, okay. I hate when I jump too high, because I'm such an athlete. <laughs> um, so, my legs are just so strong. The Rodian. I don't think you got it. Oh, but you're getting shot at, so yeah. There's, you should take care of that a, first. There was a sniper. I like that you're using Han Solo's gun as a stormtrooper. Yeah. It's pretty awesome. Maybe I disarmed him. So the... I um, just watched that guy, that guy die. Mm-hmm. Welcome to my life, man. Uh, <laughs> Roman scene stuff. There was a story I've heard um, from the set of Lord of the Rings. What's the actor's name? Christopher Lee. Yes. Right? Oh, yeah. He played yeah. Count Dooku and um, Sauron. Yeah. And apparently, at one point, Peter Jackson said something to him, because like you know, when Sauron dies, and he said something to him like, "Imagine the sound a man makes when he gets stabbed in the back," and Christopher Lee responds with, "I don't have to imagine." Oh, because he's a, he's a, he's, a, he's, a, he's an incredible human being. Yeah, he he's seen stuff. Like I was, after I heard that, I looked up Whoa, his I history, him. and like he hunted Nazis in World War Two. Of course he did. 
Yeah, right. <laughs> You're like, oh, you were you were Brad Pitt in Glorious Bastards. Got it. <laughs> what did what did you do for work? Oh, you were a Nazi hunter. <laughs> I feel like, yeah, that's like the one, like, if you hear someone, like, if you hear someone was in a war, right, they're still like, oh, you guys are losing now, dude. Yeah, we are. If you hear someone's in a war, most most wars in the world now, currently, they're, they're like a little political, not a little, but they're very politically charged. There's always, like, a disagreement. Yeah. You know? And, like, e even people who don't support the war most of the time still support the veteran. Uh, but if someone was like a soldier in World War II and fought Nazis, you never really hear any backlash from that. It's like, okay, you're yeah, a hero. Yeah, you're like, yeah, okay, I get it. <laughs> Good job. Yeah. Even though, I mean, if, you know, most of the Nazis were also not wanting to be there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wish it was more accurate. Or a little easier to control, maybe. It looks like it could be a little rough. So it seems like your gun is not as strong now. It was <laughs> the, the beginning of the round. You were, I don't it know. It was like I was get... walking around with a cannon. <laughs> Do they get, like, armor upgrades or something? Look, the computers don't pick them up. I'm just so walking around and pick up their scraps. Yeah, you were, like, you were scoring all the points, essentially. Um, how do you get a, a hero character or a villain? I'm not sure. I assume it's like a point. Oh, maybe it's the collectibles. You don't think? Could it be? I I remember doing it in the beta, you know and what? like how I picked up the squad shield. Yeah. That's the same way as the heroes function. So after a certain amount of time, it'll like spawn it in. Man, how do you summon a? You just killed Finn. I was just thinking that. And this game's canon. <laughs> oh, what? A mofo. I was like, I got a violet incredible shield. Oh, I thought of something funny. So D Disney owns Star Wars now. That's true. Uh, a couple weeks ago, I was um, shooting the castle lighting at Magic Kingdom. And they have this whole show that's probably supposed to be cute where Anna and Elsa and Olaf and Kristoff light the castle. But I really, I don't like Frozen. I'm yeah. so sick of it. I don't like As it. As most people are. So I just kind of watched. But I thought it'd be really funny because they were saying how, like, they needed someone to freeze the castle because they thought it looked pretty. And they were like, but who do we have? And the obvious joke was that Elsa was right there. But I was just waiting for Frozone to come out and be like, you guys need something? That would have been... I would have lost it. That would have been amazing. Hey, hey everybody, Incredibles 2. Oh, yeah, that is happening. <laughs> I was going to say, you... <laughs> I don't, for some reason, I thought it that not. I was immune to fire. <laughs> I'm not. Hey, now you know. Spoilers. It's canon. It's canon. Stormtroopers are not immune to fire. Do you think they're going to kill Chewbacca in the newest movie? Yeah. Me too. Wow, what do you mean you feel like crap? It also, also because Peter Mayhew is just not in good health, sadly. He's not going to be in it for very, he's not going to be in it long. You all think? I don't think, because he's not going to, they're not going to put him in that costume for more than a couple scenes. Yeah. Okay, well, hey, you know, there's always next time, buddy. We'll do it co-op. You know how we, what we've learned in Game Time Fun? Yay. It's okay to give up. It is. It's okay to give up always. Cool. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you back here for episode two. Well, I cry. <laughs> Attack of the Clones. Ha, 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 ha.